Talk To Me Tuesday and it is November the 24th um, and uh, yeah I haven't done a huge amount of crafting this week my first note is that I sent off my postcards on Friday last week and I forgot to email you Jennifer I'm so sorry but they were sent off and so they should be on their way well they are on their way providing the post office hasn't lost them <laughs> um, and this week I have what have I been doing I have mostly been making doll things so I showed you my doll last week where she was and she now looks like this so she has a little little skirt on and she has these cute little hairbands in her hair and um, I so far have made her this skirt which matches her hairbands actually I have made her this skirt which has got cute cute little uh, where are they no that hand Ooh. there we go cute little pandas on it that was weird <laughs> I've made her um, a tutu because uh, you know every girl needs a little purple tutu and I have also made her a little red riding hood cloak um, which has a really big head because it has to fit over all that hair so yeah, it's just a little cloak with some pretty ribbons on it so um, yeah she'll have some more clothes being made for Christmas um, so I'm sure you'll see more of her and I have also been working today on my Batman doll for my son he's not a doll he's a softy can't say doll because my son will tell me off this is what he looks like so far and he has this kind of sparkly body and he only has one glove right now because I haven't quite finished the gloves yet because um, I need to make the pointy bits a bit more pointy so he has one glove um, and he has this cute little bat cape on the back with the Batman symbol which I just um, applied it on I actually got some some Batman fabric <laughs> to cheat so I applied it on I have to put his face on and I have to make him a utility belt and um, some like stockingy things on his feet and his gloves and then he'll be ready to go um, and yeah so he's for my son and then I've got another doll to make for my niece and aside from that I don't really have a lot else to show you um yeah it's it's been a quiet one this week again um still trying to get used to working and sewing and looking after a house and kids and a husband and all that jazz um I do have this fantastic fabric I'm gonna make my doll a dress out of this my friend gave me this it's just a scrap of unicorn fabric but my daughter will love that so yes there she is there's, there's the fabric anyway don't know why it's a she um but yeah aside from that i am gonna keep this one really short because i am so tired that i need to go and have um, an early night and get some sleep uh, and yawn <laughs> excuse me there you go that's the yawn that went around the world uh, i'm sending my yawn to you to in America because you know you're going to yawn once you've watched that um, and that I believe is it really yeah nothing else to show hopefully next week I'll have a bit more else to show you I've got a couple of um, quilts that I want to make um, and get sorted so I'm sure I'll be talking about those in the next few weeks and Christmas and yeah and also um I just wanted to be a feedback for that I'm, I'm down to do the December price um, and I just wanted to know what you were interested in having because craft supplies over here um, are, are not that you know we don't have anything more than what you have we certainly don't have anything that you can't get in America and probably cheaper in America but I was thinking of doing either a UK or Oxford themed um, craft package so I was thinking either an Oxford University scarf or hats or something UK themed that I could send to you so if there's anything particularly that you would like um, that you can't get in America 
or that you just would like because it has Oxford or the UK on it or you know something like that um, please put something in the comments and then I'll decide which one of those is uh, is a good one but I, I was thinking of a a scarf um, an Oxford University scarf or t-shirt or something like that something that um, you couldn't necessarily get in America cheaper than you can get it in in the UK but let me know what you think because uh, I don't want to cop out if you want crafty supplies I can do that but um, our wool and things is just double the price of what you guys pay our fabric is more expensive so um, unless there's a specific one that you can't get over there which I don't think there are any <laughs> it's mostly we can't get it over here and you can get it over there so um, yeah anything from the UK that you can't get or that you've got your eye on I don't know let me know and I will um, yeah make a decision as to what the prize is going to be and on that note I'm going to keep it there because it's really short and I'm really tired <laughs> oh this is my hairband by the way for my it's just a little stretchy piece of elastic with a little um, pander on it although I've sewn over her eye but I don't think my daughter will notice anyway I'm going before I ramble on about stuff that doesn't really matter and uh, yeah <laughs> bye have a good week bye